Okay, I'm going to show you today how to link records that you found on Ancestry.com with Family Search and Family Tree. So first thing, go to Google and type in Chrome Record Seek. I guess first first thing is make sure that you are using Google Chrome and not Internet Explorer or Mozilla Firefox or something else. And then we're going to click on this one right here. This is what we call a Chrome extension. Should look like this. We're going to hit Add to Chrome, Add Extension. And then we see this Remove from Chrome, meaning it is added. And we see the icon up in this top corner here. Now we're going to go over to Family Search and sign in. And and make a search in Ancestry. And let's say this is the record that I would like to attach. Now, first I'm gonna come back here and click on this, left click, left click to copy this ID. Come back to this record, click on my Record Seek button. And it's going to tell me I'm creating a source I want to link it to Family Search. And if there's anything I want to add here, as far as the source title or any of these things, I can add additional information. But I'm just going to hit Next. And then I can either type in all this information to try and find the right person, or if I'd copied the Family Search ID, I just paste it there and hit Next again. Uh, a reason why I am attaching this source, and then hit Create and Attach. Congratulations. We can now, if we want to, go to that profile on Family Search. And I just saw that sources go from 39 to 40. There we go. Here is the record that we just attached uh, William Heaton Find a Grave Index. And if we want to, we can view that source. It will take us to Ancestry, right back to the source that we linked. It's a really easy way to link the things you're finding in Ancestry over to Family Tree. Interestingly enough, you can even use this link on any page. Say you found a legacy obituary for someone that you wanted to link. You can click that same button and put the, again, person ID in, copied from Family Search, and attach it just like you would for an, a record from Ancestry.com. Thanks. I hope you found this helpful.